it's really interesting like what we have access to and Sheen, I got your permission to do this and I didn't let you hear it before we did it but um, I took a snippet of your interview with Alex Fulick off of YouTube and I cloned your voice. Oh God. I did get his permission to do this. <laughs> um, and so I'm gonna play just a little clip. Frank, this is the real Shane Matthew. I wanted to let you know that you're doing a, uh, a great job on this panel. Also, I'm gonna call my bank now and have them wire you $5,000. Just let me know where you want it sent. I don't so, recall that conversation. Yeah. <laughs> Through the evolution of our industry, we are constantly unleashing the power of applying resilience to our organizations. So this is where we learn about the trends. We grow our education about our industry and our career. And we are surrounded by a diverse network of thought leaders. I was wondering if you and me could spend an hour unleashing your resilience power. A lot of people believe never waste a good crisis and they say that <laughs> yes i say and we should say we are as good as the last crisis uh, look everyone in this room feels it we know it in our our, our our hearts our experience that critical events are becoming more severe they're becoming more frequent uh, and it's not isolated to a single industry it's not about a single function it's not about a geography uh, it, is, it is rarely one event at a time. The show's been great. There's been uh, some really great sessions, really great topics. The speakers, I think, have been spot on. Uh, and I've really had a great chance to catch up with some folks I haven't seen in a long time. And as well, I've got a great chance to meet some new folks and make some new friends. It's been a great session here at SeaWorld, reconnecting with folks. Again, the sessions, you know, have been up to date, you've got a lot of uh, AI, generative AI, uh, ransomware, exercises, so things that are all relevant in our current industry. I definitely enjoyed it. It was my first time attending the conference and being that I'm transitioning from network security to more of the B, uh, BCDR space, um, it gave me confidence to let me know that I was moving in the right direction as well as some innovative ideas. It's been an amazing conference as always at the DRJ Spring 2024. I really liked how we talked about AI, looking at metrics, and also just talking about the future of the profession, getting young people involved. So very much looking forward to the fall conference in Dallas, Texas. Uh, it was amazing. There was a great amount of networking. We had some of the best vendors uh, and partners uh, exhibiting some of the latest products. What was really nice is a mix of topics ranging from traditional BCDR to the engagement of cyber uh, with artificial intelligence, the right topics for the right people that made everybody mingle together and come together. For me, each time is really about the people, the people I meet, the conversations I have, really being able to make the connections. And obviously there's always great takeaways from all the sessions, but that's really what I love about DRJ. We've definitely had the opportunity to meet with and to connect with some of the vendors as well as um, you know, meet with some of the vendors that we currently have, as well as explore opportunities for new vendors. I would say it's great because you can um, have one-to-one -one conversations with the vendors and really talk about you know, what works for you, what doesn't work for you. They can just have that one-on-one -on -one time with you, whereas if you're looking at it online, you don't really have that experience to see if it's, it's a good fit for you. So I would say it's a great opportunity to see the vendors here, to talk with them, um, and to test out possible products that would work for you. I really enjoyed the DRJ this year. It's been a lot of good information sharing and good networking going on. My role has changed a little bit to include some risk management. So I've got some uh, risk uh, sessions in this, this year and uh, appreciated what, every, what I've been able to learn. The networking here has been great. Uh, in addition to the BCI uh, monthly chats that I've joined, I've been able to meet some of those people here, but then also some new people as we've joined conversations and uh, talked about what BC is with uh, each of our roles.